right, thank you, Mike. We'll talk in a bit. Now with more storms moving in, we're hoping to avoid a repeat of situations like this one in Sheridan. Oh boy, police tell us that woman was able to jump out just before her SUV plunged into that sinkhole opening up beneath her. Denver 7's Lance Hernandez joins us from uh, the unexpected canyon at Oxford and Santa Fe. So what, uh, what do we know caused this? Well, the city of Inglewood uh, says there was a tremendous amount of rain in a short period of time. Now, they own those six-foot-tall uh, concrete stormwater pipes, and they say the two-and-a-half inches of rain that fell in 30 minutes last night put more pressure on those pipes than they were designed to handle. Cell phone video shows Ashley Marish's RAV4 being swallowed up by an expanding sinkhole. Today, Ashley sent us this photo of the SUV in the water. She didn't want to talk on camera but did say, I'm feeling very overwhelmed and still in shock. But most of all, I feel blessed and am thankful that I had a guardian angel there to help get me out of the car. I hope he knows how grateful I am that he was there to help me. Police say if Ashley hadn't gotten out when she did, she might not have survived. That water was so high in, the, in that sinkhole, once her car went down, the uh, car was already submerging and the water was rushing pretty good. And I don't really see how we could have done anything to get a person out of that. Today, as work crews recovered the car, bystanders watched in awe. It makes me feel like I don't want to drive on this road. <laughs> Take the back roads. It's a mangled mess. If she hadn't gotten out in time, she could have been killed. You know? Tonight, with more rain expected, American Civil Contractors is still working on repairs to the six-foot diameter concrete stormwater pipes that failed last night, causing the sinkhole. Now, eastbound Oxford remains closed here just west of Santa Fe. The city of Inglewood referring to last night's rainstorm as a 100-year event. In Sheridan, Lance Hernandez, Denver 7. I believe it. Thank you, Lance. And even